Your brain pulsates and moves around in your skull. When having brain surgery, the anesthetist has to administer specific medications to slow down and minimize the movement to help avoid accidents. Everyone has learned about Pavlov's dogs in school. The dogs were trained so that when the bell was rang, they'd get hungry. What no school teaches was just how he got his data. With some dogs, he cut holes in their throats so the food would fall out so he could measure the amount of saliva in the food. With other dogs, he would cut holes in their stomach so the food would fall out just so he could measure the amount of stomach acid produced. Horrific. They were given all the food they could eat, yet they all starved to death. I can't imagine that many things worse than that. If the sun suddenly ceased to exist, it'd be eight and a half minutes before we knew. All photosynthesis would immediately stop, plants would eventually die, followed by the animals that relied on those plants. The surface temperature would steadily drop. Within a week, the average global temperature would drop below zero degrees Fahrenheit. Within a year, the average global temperature would fall below one, minus 100 degrees Fahrenheit. The ocean would be frozen over, but the water underneath would take thousands or even hundreds of thousands of years to fully freeze from the surface to the floor. Eventually, the average global temperature would level out at around minus 400 degrees Fahrenheit, at which point the atmosphere would have frozen and fallen to the earth exposing any life that managed to survive to the harsh cosmic radiation. Dimethyl mercury exists. A single drop will kill you in agonizing pain over several weeks to months as your body slowly fails and it's able to pass through most protective equipment. Dimethyl mercury is also known as mercury dimethanide. It's an extremely toxic organic mercury compound a highly volatile, reactive, flammable, and colorless liquid. There have been three cases of human poisoning by dimethyl mercury. All have proven fatal. This is due to very small amounts of this highly toxic chemical resulting in devastating neurological damage and death. Anesthesia Awareness It happens when certain people go into surgery and they don't give you enough anesthesia. It will look like you're asleep, eyes closed, not talking or moving, but the patient can still hear and feel everything that's happening, but you're unable to move, speak, or open your eyes. So unless a monitor that shows your brain activity is present, you're stuck with having to endure the pain throughout the rest of the surgery. Prion infections. They can't be treated and they have a 100% fatality rate and instruments can't be sterilized via traditional means when exposed. A prion is a type of protein that can trigger normal proteins in the brain to fold abnormally. Prion diseases can affect both humans and animals and are sometimes spread to humans by infected meat products. The most common form of prion disease that affects humans is Jacob's disease, also known as CJD. All known prion diseases in mammals affect the structure of the brain and other neural tissue. All are progressive and have no effective treatment and are always fatal. Cats and dogs will eat you when you are dead. They tend to go for the neck, face and any exposed areas first and then if not discovered in time they will proceed to eat the rest of you. There have been numerous cases of this occurring. Maybe not as disturbing as other posts, but the act of hitting someone in the head won't actually knock them out. It's more likely to kill them. In movies, you see people hit a person on the head with something heavy like a brick or a book or even heavier items. This won't knock a person out so much as give them a concussion or flat out just kill them. Our heads are pretty fragile. Landing wrong from a simple fall can even kill you. And it's also why football is insanely dangerous. Brain aneurysms can happen whenever and for no reason at all. A brain aneurysm is a weakness in a blood vessel in the brain that balloons and fills with blood. Most intracranial aneurysms occur between the underside of the brain and the base of the skull. The aneurysm can leak or rupture, causing life-threatening bleeding. 
Because their necks are so long, it takes a giraffe 30 minutes to grow up, lol. It can take up to 15 minutes to several hours depending on the size of the giraffe and the amount of vomit. If your stomach doesn't develop a new layer of mucus every two weeks, the acid would cause your stomach to dissolve. The fact that a school that openly admitted to abusing children was allowed to operate for 40 years even after several state audits witnessed abuse occurring. It shut down in 2011 because of money problems. The people who abused kids there got away with what they did. Seriously, for those who have the stomach for it, look up Elan School. They killed a 15 year old and covered up his death. Despite widespread condemnation of the practice, performing pelvic exams on unconscious women for medical training without explicit consent is legal in 30 states. California has a law against cremating more than one body at a time in a cremation. The law is directly because of the Lamb Funeral Home, which was run by a man out, which was run by a man with the nickname Little Hitler, by his staff who would stuff as many bodies as possible into one crematory and also sold prosthetics and gold teeth of the bodies allegedly tried to poison a competing funeral director who suspected him had coke cans full of teeth in his house walls and more fun fact if the poisoning was proven it would have been the first legally recorded international oleander poisoning Approximately 5 pounds of your body weight is bacteria. Edgar Allan Poe wrote a novel in 1838 in which four shipwrecked survivors, at the point of starvation, chose to resort to cannibalism. So they killed the youngest cabin boy, Richard Parker, and ate him. In 1884, a ship called it the Magnonette sank. Four crew members, at the point of starvation, killed it and ate the youngest of them, Richard Parker. Adult teeth and toddlers are right under their eyes. Drowning is quiet, and most kids drown right in the front of the person who's supposed to be watching them. In the United States, every year, it's estimated that 4,000 fatal unintentional drownings occur. That is an average of 11 drowning deaths per day. 8,000 non-fatal drownings. That is an average of 22 non-fatal drownings per day. Coffin birth occurs when gas builds up inside of a body of a deceased pregnant woman and forces the fetus out of the birth canal. Not so fun fact, Algeria's national anthem was written in blood on the wall of a prison cell. <laughs>